for just two days to go until Halloween, but fear not, we've got some simple tricks to help you haunt your house. We are calling this our Halloween to die, DIY for, get it? Ooh, yeah, they like that. <laughs> Martha Stewart, living editor-in-chief Elizabeth Graves is here. Thank you for coming. Thanks for having just me. Just in time to show happy, us some tricks. Yes, happy almost Halloween. Happy almost Halloween, starting with these kind of spooky smoke and mirrors. You're gonna yes, show us how to do we it. We have great last minute ideas that yeah. you can pull off and um, you know, whether you're having people over or you wanna freak out the entire family, they're very easy. We did the handiwork for you on okay. the mirror. All you need to do is go to Martha Stewart dot com backslash haunted mirror download our template go to your local copier have them print it out on what this is a window cling and we have it in two sizes for small mirrors ah. and for large mirrors <laughs> and all you do is, is smooth it out and you'll be good you'll be ready to scare. easy all right yeah. i could do that as long as that's easy enough okay so you've also got and now if you look at the sconces oh, um they, spooky sconces spooky yes. sconces what makes something spookier than a snake um you can raid you can raid your kids um toy box or you can buy them very inexpensively at any craft or halloween headquarters twist them around anything they work around sconces yeah you, you might even already have these at home yeah like you, say. you can use them do. later for um april fool's day too they come in handy oh, just don't use them on anyone who has a heart condition spooky centerpieces <laughs> Yeah, if you're having a dinner party, do this. These are things that we took. You might remember them from good old science class. Oh, this yeah. is just a good you just old happen skull. to have a skull sitting around just, your house. Yeah, a skull <laughs> sitting around. They have they naturally have a hole in mm -hmm. the bottom that you can put the flowers in. So that's an easy idea there. Oh yeah, that looks great. That looks great. And I love that these ideas you can keep and you can do again and again. You're so not, every year you put it in a yeah, box, put it in the garage, in the box, or something do it like again. That. Yeah. They like that. <laughs> these are these are also, you might remember them from anatomy class. So where do you get these? You can get them on Amazon. You can get them at an educational um, type store. Uh -huh. um, you can, and again, all those Halloween stores have Easy. everything. The but audience you... interaction today is above board. <laughs> really, really. I know, yeah, I love really. it. <laughs> and you know, just put it around pillar candles. You can do them any way you want. Mm -hmm. Put them in a nice death grip, and and you you got something good for a great tablescape. Totally, these are great. Okay, so we've got some jars here. This looks these are X-rays. These are simple X-rays that you can also get online. All you do is slip oh, wow. them in, put them in a votive. Oh, that's Done. easy. Oh. All right. Put that one in there. And you can put them on your windowsill. You can do them for trick or treaters. Different sizes, yeah. And again, a simple idea that you can do year after year, and you can get known as the scariest house on the block. We're into this. <laughs> Thank you. And easy. And you can set them all. You can have it all year long if you need. Pull it out. Definitely. Do it. Easy peasy. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. We love this. Yeah.